guys, welcome back to my channel. So I am here to show you my keto haul video of all the foods that I purchased today. I went to Walmart and Target. And uh, just a disclaimer, I'm not a keto expert. I have just done keto a couple of times for my diet and I just wanted to share with you all everything that I purchased today. And I ended up spending about um, $60 on everything and then I'm gonna get back some more money first uh, with couponing and things like that because y'all know I am a big couponer and I like to save money. So uh, with the keto diet, it's mostly about very high protein, high fat, low carb, no carb, no sugar. So everything you see here is very, very low carb. Um, it may not be exactly, exactly like a keto uh, per se, but this is what I'm going to eat for the next week or so. So I just wanted to share with you all everything that I got. So we can go ahead and get started on the protein side and then we'll work our way over to the veggies side. So um, the biggest tip that I have for you all is to get something in with meat in bulk. So right here we have a five pound log of ground beef and this retails for about $10 and some change at Walmart. Uh, if you buy the one pound log, they're probably, they're gonna range you about, uh, we'll say three to four dollars. So you save a lot of money by buying it in bulk. The same thing goes with these chicken wings. So I got a whole pack of chicken wings and they are $10.53 for this bag. Basically it says it's uh, $2.27 a pound. And if you buy like the half pound bag, I think that one was $2.99 a pound. So I went ahead and bought it in bulk. And what I'm going to do is um, portion out everything of what I want to eat and then put it in my freezer that way I can store it and just eat it whenever I want to and it's cost efficient friendly. So obviously we got steaks which is very great for keto and bacon. You cannot go wrong with bacon. I got some pepperonis. These are really good when you are snacking and if I'm going to make a pizza which is what I want to try to do with either cauliflower crust or a chicken crust. So. I will find an idea for that. The next best tip um, to get is a rotisserie chicken. And this is already pre-cooked, it's pre-made, it's seasoned, it's hot, it's ready to go. They cost you around $46 per bird, and uh, depending on the store and where you go to. And it's so easy and you just eat it and you just go and you can make so many different things, obviously with chicken. So I picked one up and I'm gonna eat this really quick for dinner tonight. And I got some sausage. Now these sausage patties are the raw kind. They're fresh, you have to cook them. These were $7 and you get 30 patties. But they do have some pre-made kinds as well in the frozen section that I saw were for $5 if you wanted to save a little bit more money. However, um, it's best to cook your own foods and have everything super fresh with keto because you wanna know what's going in your body. So that's why I went ahead and get got the uh, raw, fresh sausage meat. Also, I got a head of cabbage, some zucchini, some tomatoes, and lemon. And I got a bag of avocados right here. These are 50 cents or so, uh, 58 cents at Walmart a piece. But if you buy them in the bag, it's $3.50. So you save a few, um, maybe a dollar or so, depending on how many avocados are in the bag. So this is a really great, avocados are the best for keto. They're high in fat, but a good fat for you. Um, you eat them for breakfast, for snack, you can eat them anytime. And yeah, that's why I like it. I got some heavy whipping cream. This is really good when you're trying to make some kind of, you know, creamy dish or whatever. It's always good to have this on hand. And the expiration date is in March and it's only January. So this lasts for a very long time. 
When you want a snack, I got some pickles. I love pickles, these are really good. And I heard a, a good tip. If you um, are having like muscle spasms or muscle cramps, drink a little bit of pickle juice and it'll go away. Um, so yeah, I got my lettuce and this will be good when I make, you know, if you wanna make some tacos, Instead of a shell, you can always use these. You could also use shredded cheese, which I already have in my uh, refrigerator, so I didn't have to buy any. I got some green beans, and I also got some dill right here. And the reason why I bought the dill was because I wanna make my own homemade ranch. And if you want a recipe on that or see how I make that, just comment down below and I can get you a video on that. And I got me some celery, and celery is really good with the rotisserie chicken to make a buffalo chicken dip that's keto friendly and it's so delicious and great for snacking, is good for a quick lunch, something like that. Also for snacking, I got two more things. I got pork rinds, which pork rinds are awesome. These are barbecue flavored by Mac. And I also got some roasted peanuts. These are salted peanuts. Nuts are a great alternative for snacking as well with keto. And that is everything that I purchased at Walmart. Um, the total came to like $86, but I did have a gift card that I used from Ibotta, which is a great program to save you some money. Um, it's a nice little app and it's coupon friendly. And I'll have my link down below in case you guys want to join Ibotta under my team and you can earn $10 like that. So I spent my gift card on that and paid $45 for everything I purchased at Walmart. And the only thing that I got from Target, they're having a sale that ends today. Um, so I'm sorry this video was uploaded so late, but the, um, the sale was spend $25 on Frozen and you get back a $5 gift card. So with that in conjunction of Ibotta, the app I was just talking about, I ended up getting all of this. I got all of these vegetables from Green Giant. Basically, these are riced veggies that you can eat. This is cauliflower. So it's just riced cauliflower. So I'm so excited to try this. You don't have to buy a cauliflower head and create your own. You can just buy this microwave it, cook it on the stove, add you know your stuff and make like a fried rice. So I'm really excited to try this one. I got so many different flavors and then I got one that's riced broccoli. So that's, that's cool. I uh, also got a cauliflower medley which has peas, carrots, and onions in here. I also got veggie tots which are all cauliflower tater tots. So you know we can't have um, potatoes, so this is the next best thing, and I just got an air fryer, so I'm gonna be trying this out. And the last thing I got were veggie spirals. So I can make some kind of pasta or something like that. But anyway, so I got all this from Target, and I ended up paying about $10 for everything from that. So everything equaled out to be about $50, $60 with my haul today. But that's all I have for you. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions at all, please leave a comment down below. Like and subscribe this video and turn on notification bell to see any more videos from me when, they, when I upload them. <laughs> but thanks, bye.